I learned about the student contest. My mom, she told me about it, and then we watched the Never Give Up documentary, and that inspired me to enter. So when I found out that I won first place in the junior division, so at first I thought that my mom was pulling a prank on me. <laughs> and then it took me a few days to process it, but I felt really proud of what I did. I chose paint for the medium because I was like kind of just experimenting around with like what I could do. And I really liked painting and I also liked making collages. So I decided to paint two of the sections fully and then the last one I decided to make it into a sort of collage as you can see there's instead of the people and other objects painted on there's there are pieces of paper that are glued on i wanted to use the panels but in my original thought it was only two the protest in the garden but i decided to add the neighborhood piece because that seemed pretty meaningful and also my first piece had Two panels were both rectangle with a straight line in the middle, but I eventually decided on the three and the two diagonal lines. I think the contest is really important for kids to participate in because one, it gives them a chance to learn and grow as an artist. And two, it's a really fun opportunity. Like even if you don't enter to win, you can still enter just to be a part of it. It's a really good idea if you're planning to expand yourself further as an artist. Another reason that I would recommend the student art contest to others is because it gives you a really good opportunity to learn about all the good things that Minya Sui has done for this community, especially, especially America too. And it also gives you an idea of like, how you could also help too. The way that filling my responsibilities and our responsibilities in the community helps is when you bring people together, it helps people make new friends and people can meet each other that probably would never interact and it would make a stronger bond throughout our community. And taking care of the community and standing up for each other also creates a bond and makes the community just a better place. Some of the responsibilities is like taking care of the community which I represented in the community garden section of my piece. It shows people like watering plants and planting things and taking care of the garden so the community can be a better place. It also Bringing people together again is represented by the middle panel of the neighborhood because it shows a bunch of people like coming together and of course standing up for other people in the community which is represented by the pro protest panel. In a sense, communities are also like a garden. If you leave it alone and don't do anything to it, it will wilt and just kind of shrivel up and die. But if you water it and nurture it and take care of it, it will flourish and become a stronger community.